gonna start this painting by laying down watercolor washes. First, I'm gonna just lay down a sky. Wetting the paper. Leave some hints of clouds in it. falls down. Okay, so try to get that darker blue off of there. As the sky gets lighter as you go towards the horizon. Okay, that's enough for now. I've let the blue of the sky dry and now I'm going to paint another color on it. First, I'm going to wet it again. A, a morning sunrise in this painting. I'm gonna let that dry. Okay, we let that one dry. 
Now here's the third watercolor wash. I want a very dark mm, grayish kind of green on there in the foreground. We'll see what it looks like. The sun hasn't actually hit this part yet, so that's why it's kind of darkish. We'll just see how we can do it. I don't mind the variations in color because the landscape will have a variation in color. And tip it up a little bit, and get the water to run down. So it's lighter in the background than it is in the foreground. Okay. I'll let that dry. Now the green part has dried, the green wash that I put on. I'm gonna put a tree line in. And I'm doing this in a dark purple. Just the ragged tops of the trees in the distance.
I'm gonna let that dry. I decided that I had messed up this painting. And so I just put a layer of white uh, acrylic paint on top, real thin wash, and um, just, you know, fiddled around with the foreground a little bit. And now I actually kind of like it. In the meantime, though, I started another one. And that is this one, which <clears throat> I used the same technique for the sky. And then I underpainted the trees in purple. And now I'm kind of working on the foreground and the trees. And uh, there you go. This one doesn't look nearly as foggy as the other one. I don't know. I might like the other one better. Foggy sunrise. Okay. Morning. This is the finished second painting of the uh, landscape that I was doing. I like the first one so much with the fog in it. I'm gonna try and add the fog to this one. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some uh, white paint, thin it down, 